hello guys uh, welcome to a new video and as you can see from the title we are going to see how you can make that weekly paycheck every week in your bank account and i'm going to divide this video in three parts so do stick around till the end because uh, at the end i'm going to show you how much i made uh, using the same strategy the first part we are going to discuss uh, why monthly is not good as weekly and then second part we are going to discuss uh, that particular stock that i am actually using and in the final part as i say i'm going to show you how much i made uh, for the couple of months last couple of months using the same strategy and you can use the same so if you are interested in all that then please do stick around and let's start okay guys so i'm in my uh, computer screen and as i said uh, on this part we are going to see uh, why weekly uh, is better uh, than monthly because uh, i see weekly there are three reasons right uh, the first one is uh, when you do weekly options you get four more uh, rounds of uh, earnings uh, as compared to when you do week uh, monthly right uh, you just get like uh, just one paycheck uh, but what we are going to discuss is uh, four paycheck every month right so for that it's very important that you do uh, weekly past variety of uh, stocks uh, you can say now uh, provide a weekly option and that is very good uh, uh, for you as a investor that's really good uh, in terms of getting uh, four uh, paychecks uh, instead of one right so th the first reason is uh, the number of times that you get to see the amount coming in your uh, account and uh, number two is uh, if you look at in terms of uh, even the amount right uh, if you do monthly right say for example uh, let's see uh, QQQ right so if you do QQQ uh, for example this uh, this is uh, by the way the NASDAQ right uh, so it tracks the NASDAQ 100 and if you look at uh, let's uh, check out the monthly right so if you do uh, sell put on monthly and I'm gonna discuss uh, the exact strategy if you're not familiar on the part two but I'm just gonna show you the premium here right so I'm just gonna let's uh, do a monthly right so if you do a month out which is almost June uh, 20 like June 14th right so if you do sell put here uh, you're gonna see uh, let's say 440 which is kind of a, um, a support kind of a range that we see so you get uh, 616 right now let's check out the weekly right so uh, in weekly case right now it's uh, May 14th so the next is I think about uh, six days right so let's do six days here and same strike price okay so let's keep the same strike price as 440 so even just one month uh, one week uh, you're getting 200 right and in, as compared to the month that you saw you're getting 600 so if you do this four times you're gonna get uh, 800 right on this case so that's why uh, weekly is better because uh, as you know right theta goes down uh, rapidly in the last week that's why you get more benefit when you're doing weekly so that was the number two point on uh, why you should do weekly versus is monthly now number three is uh, i kind of touched upon this on the first part uh in earlier uh, there were only monthly options like even for uh, today right there are some uh, stocks that you would find only in uh, monthly right but uh, they're like uh, for example bank of america right let's see the uh, bank of america here so if i look at um, bank of america right so this stock earlier this used to have only monthly options but now uh, they do provide weekly right a lot of uh, dividend kind of stocks which used to have only monthly but the, now they offer weekly so uh, that's the third point which is like you have a good amount of options when it comes to the choices that you can make now uh, versus what you used to have uh, maybe let's say uh, 10 years uh, before right so that's a good uh, choice that you have you can choose from uh, all kinds of in all different sectors there are multiple options to choose from 
okay so part two is uh, the stock that i'm using right so i'm actually using uh, uh, so excel right so this is the one that i am using and uh, if you don't know this is basically tracks all the semiconductor uh, uh, market mainly comprised of uh, nvidia and amd and if you look at uh, right now uh, also i have a position open and uh, uh, if i go to my history right let's see so if i go back here right so if you look at uh, i have been doing this uh, for a number of times now and I'm doing it successfully I'll show you how much I gained uh, in my last part on where I show you how much I have actually made in last couple of months so we will go there so before that uh, let's look at the strategy itself right so uh, if you are a completely beginner into the option trading then I have I have a lot of us which shows uh, goes in much detail I'm not going to touch too detail into every aspect of how to execute this i'm just gonna uh, keep it brief and this so the strategy if you are interested by the way in going in too much detail i will uh, definitely put uh, those uh, link down in the description you can go check them out after uh, this video okay coming to the strategy right so what you do is you are basically doing this uh, sell and put you're selling a put and you can select as i say always uh, go for a, a weekly so we can go let's say start from uh, may 24th right so if i do here and since i am doing it uh, for some time 40 is kind of a good kind of a range as i see right now based on where the market is and see i am getting 147 credited right so if i do play this i get 147 right for a week which is pretty uh, good return on your investment because how much uh, you are actually putting at uh, as a capital is uh, about 4000 right and it shows the max loss as 3854 is basically because you're receiving 145 146 as the premium so uh, the scenario wise so let's say uh, on may 24th right if the so excel closes above 4000 you just keep uh, all the 146 to yourself and then you repeat it again next week and you just re keep repeating it until let's say uh, in in a week uh, or maybe down two three weeks you're doing it successfully and then uh, it it closes below 4000 right so that's not an issue because uh, you can uh, basically get assigned on that so excel at 4000 and then you what you do is you can repeat and start doing covered call one thing though if it goes let's say two down right uh, you should have some capital of of some percentage of what you are actually putting at risk right so here you are doing a 4000 you can let's say 20% uh, you keep it as cash so as soon as if the market really turns uh, upside down you have some money to uh, put that and average it down so if you average it down that will help you to do the covered call next time what you do right so that's why uh, you should always have uh, some cash in hand and that will help you to average it down otherwise you'll have you will have to just sit there and then wait for it to come back so always keep that uh, by the way i've discussed this in more detail uh, there are a lot of aspects that i'm not touching so definitely do check the other videos on that this one is a quick one uh, to show you how you can make this quick uh, money every week so that was uh, the stock that i'm using and now let's uh, check out how much i have made uh, uh, for last couple of i'll just take uh, for just for a may month i am going to show you for i think it has only been uh, two weeks in may so i'm just gonna show you how much i made using the same as excel okay guys uh, so this is the uh, sheet that i have been maintaining uh, with for all my uh, options trading uh, for all the profit and losses i filtered it by so excel so as you can see right these are only for the last uh, couple of weeks in may and i started with uh, 3rd may and then it uh, i did uh, two i think i am i'm doing two contracts so that's why you see two entries here so i did two two contracts and there is one open right 
now and if i add all these right they're more than uh, of, uh, close to like uh, i think it's more than 500 dollar plus some change so you can see the power of this right you are not sitting on like a monthly you're just uh, getting this uh, income every week this also uh, as you if you compare to the swing trading right uh, this uh, option trading is is a regular income that you get into your uh, account right in terms of swings trading until you actually sell the stock you don't get anything but in this case you are just using your money you are not buying anything you're just using your money to keep rotating and keep generating that income week over week so that's the beauty of options trading so that was it guys for this video and if you have any questions related to this uh, do put your questions down in the comment and i do reply to all of them and in general if you are interested uh, in more strategies uh, in terms of options then do check out my other videos i'll talk to you in my next video guys happy investing bye bye